Ah, October. The month of terror. Spooks and general horrors beyond human comprehension. And what better way to celebrate Spooktober than by enjoying a masochistic horror game? So today, I decided to turn Project Zomboid into a true horror experience, creating terrifying situations that would challenge my sanity. So join me in the 30 Days of Horror Challenge. Hello everyone, um, welcome to the 30 day challenge. Oh geez. <laughs> so, as you saw on the intro, let me move somewhere. Oh my god, wait, first of all, let me just... I think I'm safe here? Maybe? I don't know. I'm getting cold. So, you you can't see me because it's dark as hell, the, the power is out, and um, I do not want to turn on the lights. Well. I have a flashlight. I do have one, a hand crank flashlight. Pretty cool, pretty nifty. I also started with a school bag with some basic supplies and a baseball bat because, you know, this is, this is, this is, this is wild. But okay, I'm gonna try to make the intro. So today we are joined by our protagonist, Heather Mason. No joke with the name today, just a really cool character that I, th I think you should all know. We are unemployed and we have these traits. You can see them. The main. Oh my god, I, 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 I heard the window break. Oh god, um, so. Yeah, in the intro, well, I don't know if I'm gonna explain it, but basically, uh, it's eternally darkness. We have a bunch of horror themed mods. Our objective is going to be to survive for 30 days. Now, on the 30th day, we're gonna have a Horde Knight, okay? The Horde Knight is gonna bring around 300 zombies to our location and we're gonna have to survive. If we survive that, then we are safe and we survive the, the challenge, okay? Sounds. Oh god, one of the mods adds like analog horror sounds and I don't know why but those ones get me the worst. They always get me. And, oh my god. We'll, we'll see how it goes, eh? Wish me luck. Wish us luck. Oh, we also have like the Tetris mod. So we have like inventory management, making it even harder. So um, yeah, let's equip this one to our secondary. Can we put it on our belt? No, we should get that. Anyways, uh, yeah. Okay, the lights are on. There we go. No zombies over there. Maybe I should keep it off for now. I'm gonna loot around. Let's see what we can find around here. Okay, some canned peaches. We're gonna need food. Uh, is there something in the freezer? No. Also the... Oh, I thought I heard... Okay, I don't know if that's from the game or from the ambience that I added for myself. Um, But my god, I heard some whispers. Maybe it's from the music. Oh my god. <laughs> I... I'm not one to play horror games. Uh, that it's, I've never tried it. What can I say? I love watching people playing them. I, I'm never the one playing them though. What is that? Bubblehead nurse? What? Is that like an outfit? Oh, that's cool. Okay. Um, I've never been one. Oh my god. I've never been one to like play them. So I don't know how good I am with horror, but for now, let's check where we are. Okay, okay, I see where we are. Yeah. Okay, maybe if I do this challenge again, I'm gonna do it without this, without the map reveal. But okay, we're just at a trailer park, you know? I think we might not use the map for a while. We'll see, we'll see. This could be very useful. Let's put it here. We still have some water, let's take some. Uh, the water is also out. Yeah, the water is also out, so... We gotta be careful. Okay, we're gonna have to go out because it, it's gonna be dark all the time. Oh god, I, I don't want to. <laughs> I do not want to. Okay, okay, let's, let's go outside. Let's see what we can find. My god, it's so dark. Oh my god, that's a lot of corpses. Ah, oh, the noise. 
noises. I hate the noises. <laughs> oh, I really hate the noises. And he sits and, and we had to spawn like in a trailer park where there's like no houses to hide. Every house has a big window. There's one of them. There's a couple. Are there anyone behind us? No. Oh my god, I hate those noses. We're gonna have to deal with them, I think. Okay, okay, there's low. There's low, so that's good. That's good for us. Ah, oh, please tell me no one is gonna sneak up on me. I should have taken Kin, kin Hearing. Ugh. Stop making noises! Go. There you go, we won down. Whoa, whoa, what was that? Okay. Just die! Okay. My god, the noises! Ah! Stop! There's one behind us. Why did you. Come on, just fall down! Anyone behind us? No. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> this is scary. <laughs> uh, and I don't know if that's a tree or something. I don't know. I'm scared. <laughs> okay. 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 Uh, let, let's check this trailer. I think I'm gonna lower my own music because I can't hear very well. Yeah, wait a moment. Okay. Oh my god. Where? There? I don't know. I can't see. The trees are in the way. <laughs> I'm scared. Okay, there you. What are you? What do you, uh, Jason Parks? Okay, that is like that was not intentional. He he just happened to spawn there. He has a machete though. That's really good. Okay, a machete is a way better weapon. Um, we already have some gloves. We're, we're gonna take them anyways. Jason fucking Borgs in my Shomboy playthrough. Okay, how are we flashlight wise? I think we can crank it. Recharge. Oh, that noise doesn't help the situation. Okay, okay, okay. We're getting cold, so we're gonna have to change our clothing in a bit. Maybe we'll take the Jason Borgs jacket. Yeah, probably. We also have the cryogenic winter moth. I, I know you can't really see that because, you know, it's dark as hell. But trust me, we do have it. So it's it's cold. Ooh, a gas mask? It is insulation. I'll think about it. I wouldn't... W I don't really want to hide my face. Uh, okay, our jacket is good, though. Okay. I mean, what do we need for insulation uh i think we need pants mainly and maybe a sweater oh there's a fishy here <gasps> it's cooked thank you food is gonna be so scarce okay let's take this do we have anything else cigarettes cigarettes are for bozos okay a hand torch that's good only losers use cigarettes that's all i have to say running out of it. Do you have? Can we wear this without taking off clothes? Yeah, we can. Okay. Um, clothes roll down. Can we wear this? We already have a. No, but this one is a bit better, I think. We already have socks. Okay, how do we look? We look terrible, but it's fine. I mean, actually, the yellow combines with the rest uh, with our hair, so I think it's okay. I don't know, man. I don't know. I'm scared. I'm scared. I I want my mom. I'm scared. Okay, so it's never gonna be daytime, as we already said. Um, I'm gonna eat like a quarter of this because I don't know when we're gonna get any more food. I really do like this, the Tetris mom. Maybe I'll use it for my regular playthroughs. Okay, what? Oh yeah, Jason. Um, maybe your jacket has better insulation. No, it doesn't. You're useless. Or maybe it does. I don't know. Uh, your pants definitely do. Let's tuck them in. Okay, we have some pants now. Hopefully that will help with the cold. Okay, let's check the next trailer. Oh my god. We need to find like a place to make our home, you know? Where we can... <laughs> Where? 
Where? Why? Why can't I see? There was a tree on me, I think. Where are you? There you are. Please stop speaking. Stop speaking. Oh my god, I'm so fast. Holy cow, I'm really good with the machete. Good job, Heather. I don't know why. Okay. Uh, do you have anything useful? No, you don't. Get out of here, bozo. Oh my god. I'm telling you, man, the noises. I don't know why, but the analog horror noises from, like, the Mandela catalog and all of that, they always get me. <gasps> Open the window. Let's go inside. Close it. Okay, nothing useful here. Do any of you have anything useful? Lisa Garland. Um, oh, this jacket. It doesn't have insulation. What? Then why is it a jacket? Butter. Butter! That's huge. <gasps> and means ground beef. That's also huge. I don't know why. I think we forgot to set it to like 10 years later, but that's totally fine. I do not mind. <laughs> Oh, we can't take too much, though, because this Tetris mob makes it difficult for us to be loot goblins. So we're gonna have to pack light out of this. Crank it. Goes outside. Did I see something? I think there's a set having a meal. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. Let's try checking the rest of the... Places. Where could we even go? <gasps> he has a rifle, but I don't think well, we're just gonna take the ammo. Can we even take the ammo? I don't think we have this space, so no, we're not gonna. <sighs> okay. Check my map. Where can we go? Where can we go to set our base of operations? Our home. Okay, we're on Riverside. Potentially, we could go to the school. I've always liked the school. Yeah. Yeah, I think that might be our... Our option. Okay, yeah, I think our objective is gonna be to go to the school. Sadly, our only thing is gonna be... Okay, let's, we're gonna go to, our, to the school. But for now, let's just loot around this area. Find useful stuff. Where? 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 Oh, there you are. Are you? I feel like I recognize those clothing. Yeah, Rosemary Winters. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I knew I recognized that. We're gonna wear the cap because it is insulation and it looks cool. And we're gonna wear the jeans. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And we're gonna wear, we're gonna be Rose Winters now. Yeah. Plus, it's... It's warmer clothing. Okay, what's here? Anything around? Anyone, rather. Oh, okay. Of course it's locked. Let's warm up. So yeah, this is a mod where we can, like, warm up with a small process to survive the cryogenic winter. Yeah, it's the best we can do, huh? do not like this. I wanted to check that car, but there's a tree right on it, and... Where? There you are. Okay. You have a duffel bag. Oh, that's good. Who's that? It's a police event. Okay. Okay, okay. Uh, sir, please come closer. Okay. Please stop making your noises, you freak! I would like that... Police best. There you go. You're down. No, stay down, please. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I want this one. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I can wear it. Oh, I'm. I'm gonna try to get a mod that hides the police best. Definitely. Lock picking for dummies. That might actually be huge. Uh, actually, this. Yeah, I think it's better. Yeah, it's way better. Okay, we're gonna drop this one. We do not need it. Um, can we... Okay. We'll take things like this. Okay. Uh, you also have a duffel bag, but I do not want it. Okay, it's fine. Um, we need to 
crank this. This car, do you think we're gonna be lucky enough to get a, a key? I doubt it. Some ammunition, a tire pump, nothing too useful. I heard something. Am I hallucinating? Maybe I am. Oh, of course you're locked. Of course you're locked. Uh, yeah, we don't have a crowbar, so... Okay. Where? 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 I heard that. Where are you? There you are. No. Yes? No. Maybe? I don't know. I thought I heard you. Okay, maybe we are safe. Hopefully. I just want to check the car. Okay, really, so... What? Oh, that's right! It's a police car! Darn it! We can't go from the back to the front! Where? Where? Where are you? I heard you. I know I did. Where the fuck are you? <laughs> Where are you, man? Come on, get out! Oh my god! Where are you? Come on! You're... here? There you are! There you are! Took you long enough! Asshole! Come on! Get over here! Come on! Stop with the noises! Oh, there's another one. Where is it? There you are. Come on, you asshole. Nice legs, though. No! Shut up! Uh, okay, it's a police officer. Maybe he'll have a gun or something. I don't know. Oh my god, there's another one. Wait, where is that one? Okay, um... Um... Um, you know what? Oh, I can't get in. Okay, it's fine, it's fine. We can take two. We can take two. Yeah, sure. Sure, we can. Okay, sir. Please come over here. Can you stop making noise? We're safe for now. Let's keep going. Um, 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 the car. The car. Yeah, the car. Hopefully those were the only ones around. Do you have a key? You have a walkie-talkie. Some ammunition. I'm very tempted to take this. I'm gonna take this. We have a duffel bag, so it's... I think we can take it. No key. Why you gotta be like that? He should've given me a key. Why no key, though? I'm gonna take the ammunition. Oh, great, it stacks. Ah, oh, thank God. It's something. We should probably drop our previous clothing. We don't have the space for it. We should try cooking that too. Let's hit another quarter. That's good enough for now. Where? Where? There you are. Please! For th Oh my god, there's more than one. What are you? Um, you know what? You know what? No! No! Why are you locked? I don't know about dealing with three at the same time. <laughs> Please stop speaking to my ear. I need to crank. Crank, 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 crank. Okay, where are you? Okay, there you are. I'm gonna lead you over here. Did I clear the... Remote? No, not the remote grass. Ah, uh, fuck it. I think I can do it. Yeah, yeah, okay. No! Okay. Window cheese still works against them. Behind me, no one behind me. Yeah, come here, come here, come here. I said come here! Okay. <laughs> Please stop with the noises. Oh, you. You're the one making the noise. <gasps> There's more than... You know what? Uh, you, 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 can, you can stay there. Yeah. <laughs> okay. okay, gonna have to deal with you. Eh. Get out of here. Oh my god, there's more! Ah! No! Ah! <laughs> That's the bite! Uh! Come on! Come on, you bastard! 
Oh wait. Ah. Oh wait. Stop. Stop. Eh. Eh. Come on, just die. Sir, please don't get up. Oh my god. No, wait. Wait. No. Stop. Stop. <laughs> Welcome back! Yeah, you didn't see anything in the past like few seconds, uh, but welcome back! Okay, now we spawn at a better place, and I kind of know what we should expect. Uh, we're at, at a bit of a safer place, so... Okay, I understand now, and I think I can explain the situation a little bit better. Let me just, you know, um, close all the curtains, so we don't get interrupted so basically what what the challenge is all about is we have to survive as i said for 30 days 30 nights pretty much we also have this we also have like special zombies they didn't load in the previous one i'm not sure why but on this one they they did load as you can see by that one uh, we have like funky mode zombies but okay we have to survive 30 nights and in the last night we're gonna have to fight a horde of 30 zombies that is gonna come straight for us ready to murder us so that's cool we're gonna have to find the supplies needed to defeat them when the time comes so we have to be ready for now, let's just focus on looting this area and trying to find gunsmithing tools. Oh, cool. Uh, I don't think I'm going to take it right now, but it's cool to know that it's there. Okay, 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 okay. We have a way better spawn, spawn point. Oh, the previous one was like trailer park. Let me tell you, there wasn't anything around. Ooh, nice. A hiking backpack. That's great. Do we have, like, both equipped, or is one... I don't think we're supposed to have, like, both on us. It's okay, we're gonna drop this one. A hacking backpack already is pretty good. Uh, a bow! This is great. There we go, now we're ready for the horror apocalypse. Alright, alright, alright. Oh, a leather jacket. It doesn't have much insulation, though, so it, it's not worth it. This one has decent... Oh, we can wear this. Good. Uh, there's also a guitar, but it makes a lot of noise, so I don't know. I'm guessing this one, yeah, it takes away our own, our own jacket, so I wouldn't want that. Oh, actually, um, we need bandages. So, yeah, let's rip the cloth. Okay, we have bandages now. Okay, those are ten. We can drop the rest. We only need ten for now. A bathroom, nothing useful. We have a bottle of water. Let's drink some. And let's fill our water bottle. Okay. We have a house this time around. Which is gonna help us a ton. So. Oh, we didn't check here. Did we check here? We probably did. Okay. Let's see where we are right now. Okay. We're pretty much in the middle of nowhere. Close to... Um, whatchamacallit? To Riverside once again. Man, I would love to go to Rosewood. Where's Rosewood? Is this Rosewood? Yeah, I think this is. Yeah. Yeah, okay. But no, we can't go there. I mean, we're so far away. So, oh, we ran out of battery. Ooh, that takes a while. Okay. I still think our best option... For now, let's load around the houses. But I do think our best option is gonna be to make our base right here. It's gonna have a lot of zombies, but if we can take this over... I don't know. It's gonna be very risky if I do that. Ooh, I don't know. This is a warehouse, right? Or a factory. We could get some supplies from here. We are in a relatively safe spot, too. But we need to think to the future. But then again, like, taking over the school right now? I don't think so. So, okay. We're gonna loot around. See what we can find in these houses. There shouldn't be too many zombies around here. Do we have any, like, any one-handed weapons? Is this a weapon? Yeah, but it's a very bad one. Uh, do you have something on you, sir? 
You have shoes. Question mark shoes. Uh, actually, we're going to cook this. We can't cook it here. Yeah. I forgot the... Um, yeah. Uh, this could be a weapon. But nah. If we use this one, we just lose all of our visibility. So we have to be very careful. Let's just use the hammer. The visibility is too important. Okay. What do we have around here? <sighs> oh, that's a hole. Oh. Let's crank it again. Let's check our minimap. Uh, there's a house right down here. Don't go through the trees. Okay. There's a zombie around here. I heard her. An abomination. Where are you? Okay. If you could please uh, c come here. But in a way that I... Oh, oh that spooked me a little bit. Hmm, I don't like your noises. I don't like your noises, ma'am. Sir, I don't know. I haven't seen you. And you all sound the same. Where are you? Come on, get out. Okay, let, let's crank this one real quick. Come on, where are you? <sighs> Come on. Where are you? I think I'm going to just walk normally so that they can see me. There shouldn't be that many in this area. Come on! I don't want to have to look through it through the woods for you. We did have the cryogenic winter, but we don't get, like, the cold. Well, we get the cold, but not the snow. Which is pretty weird. Maybe we should get a... Oh, ho, 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 what is that? What is that? My God! I did not expect that! What are you? Um... Um... Oh, wow, I did not expect that. I did not expect that at all. Oh, God, come on. Fall down. I'm hitting your tip. That sounded bad. Can you fall over? Okay. There's one behind me. No, it was the wind. What the? Oh. Wow, oh, it's a wolf. How the hell are wolves alive? How did... What do you mean you had a bra and panties? Where were you keeping those? What the hell? <laughs> okay. Well, let's go to the shed. Okay, I did not expect that. I expected a lot of things, not horrors beyond my imagination. Where? 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 Okay, it's... I think they're at a door. My god! Okay, I think they're inside. Please stop knocking, just, just, I don't want to go inside. <laughs> and the worst part is... <laughs> the worst part is I don't know where the sounds come from. Because with this mod, the sounds come from everywhere. Like, I hear them from over there, but I think they're over here. Stop! Oh, there it is. Oh! What are you? What are you? Okay, God. Good thing I didn't go inside. I'm gonna wait for them to break it. Because I, I do not want to jump a window with them over there. Oh god, what is, what's all, no one here, right? No. Gentlemen, please break the door. I think they're gonna take too long to do that. I'm gonna have to go inside. I do not want to go inside. Oh, there, there's a tree there, huh? I can't see, dude. It's so dark. Okay, there's one over there. Is there anyone behind me? No, okay. Here's the plan. I'm gonna remove the broken glass. This little set is a little bit distracted. Okay. Please stop! Okay. There, I think the other one is like stuck, is locked to the door. No, they broke it. That's the one we saw. 
What are you? You have a leg for a head. You have two tootsies. What are you? <laughs> there we go. There's another one. There you are. What are you? You have tentacles. There's another one outside. Yeah. No. I'm gonna close that. Okay. Oh god. A guitar and some boots and a gun case, but I don't want to shoot a gun yet. But maybe I'm gonna have to. Okay, let's take this. We haven't done much, have we? It's just been horror after horror. <sighs> How? I don't even know the time. They don't have clocks on them. We're gonna have to eat these chips. Stop with the noises. Do you have any, like, one handed weapons? No, okay. Let's crank it. Where are you? God, where are you? A screwdriver would actually be a really solid weapon. Even if it's... Oh, this flashlight is better. Yeah, okay, actually we're gonna equip this one. Okay, great. I hear them. Read the woods. Is this food? <gasps> it's rice, but it's uncooked. That's rough. That's rough, buddy. <gasps> Ooh, this, a meat cleaver. This is gonna be a really solid weapon. Okay, great. Uh, we have some spaghetti. Mom's spaghetti. We have an apple. Let's eat it. We have some packaged corn. We're gonna eat them all, too. Stop whispering to my ear. Fucking asshole. You gonna come inside? I know you're out there, dude. Please. There you are. Oh, it's one of you, huh? That's fine. I do not mind. Come. Come. I took one of you down. I'll take you too. I'm guessing the head is on the tip. Do you have anything on you? Just this thing, What? whatever it is. What is this? Oh, it's something you can wear, huh? Oh, I don't know. I, I, I do not want to do that. Okay. The good thing is that they make a lot of noise, so we always know where they are. They can't sneak up on us. Okay, let's check that other area. Hear anything? Actually, we have a propane thing over here. We're gonna cook some food. We're gonna sleep in this house, most likely. And you know, the worst part is that they don't wear clothes. Well, some of them do, some of them do. Actually, I should check that zombie that had some clothes. Okay, actually, we're gonna put these things in the small spots so we can keep the big spots for the big stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's play it smart. You had some meat, right? Yeah. Um, rice, uh, cooking, prepare rice. There we go. Okay. This is a... I wanted to say this is a safe spot, but... No, it's not. But we clear this area, so we can be here. Okay. Do you work? Uh, actually, I think it doesn't. Oh, no, it does. It does. It does. Never mind. We just have to turn it on from here. Okay. Let's actually... We're going to turn it off for a little bit. Because we are relatively safe right now. There we go. There we go. Uh, turn it off. Turn it off. Turn it off. Okay. We have food. Really good food. Uh, let's eat a quarter. Okay. Good, good, good. We're doing it, guys. We're doing it. Now, let's go check out this other area. Hello? Is anyone inside? No. Okay. Okay, okay. We're relatively safe. Another flashlight. We're gonna need a lot of those. A gas can. If we ever find a car, which I don't think we will, that would be very good. A saw. That could be good to dismantle some stuff. We already have a hammer. Ooh, this is a good weapon. It's a very deep weapon. Is this one better than this one? 13, and this one has 26. Yeah, it's not better, but we might take it anyways. Yeah. I think we can keep them inside too. Yeah, okay. So we can combine them. Which makes sense. Yeah, you know what? I need every, oh, every advantage that I can get. <laughs> okay, what's next? Okay, now we're gonna check the one down south. We have a fan. It's the wind. It's the wind. That's not the wind. That's not the wind. That is definitely not the wind. 
What are you? What do you have in your face? Come over here, sir. Oh. I don't know how I missed that one. Oh, I can't hit him because of the bush. Woo -hoo. Woo -hoo. Eh. 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 Oh, okay. No, no clock, huh? I could really use a clock right about now. Where? 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 I heard you. There you are. Uh, you're just a dude. Oh, what are you? Why are you walking like that? Why do you have so many holes? Stop having so many holes. What is this? Note one. Oh, no, that, that doesn't matter here, I think. Oh. What are you? Oh, you have like a hoodie, I think. Don't scream at me. No clock. Okay, a clock. Oh, hello. Newly wet, huh? I get it. Please fall over. Oh, God. Don't scream at me. Okay. Okay. Uh, now we know the time. That's good. It doesn't really matter that much because, you know, it's always going to be nighttime. But still, it's good to know. We should get a digital watch, though. That would help more. Why was there a bright here in the middle of the woods? I can't see. There are so many trees that obstruct vision. Okay, there's one. Come over here. There you go. Anyone else? I don't hear anything. I'm telling you, it's really spooky, but it's also... Where? Are you inside? You're probably inside. There you are. I see you. Okay, 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 okay. I can deal with you. What are you? I did not see a shape on you. I saw something. I heard something else. <sighs> yeah, I hear one more. Dude, this is terrifying. Any like lead pipes or something? No, lead pipe, lead pipe. No. Oh God, where, where? Oh, why well, you gotta do it like that? They're hitting a. Oh, I know where they are. Yeah. Oh, oh, they're right here. <laughs> oh, oh. You're hitting that with your with your head leg, ma'am. Why are you crying? Are you okay? Don't scream at me. You're overreacting. <sighs> okay, I'm I'm getting a bit better at handling this. It's still so spooky, man. Like holy shit. Like those are singular abominations you know nothing too wild imagine when we get the horde night the 30 days of pain and suffering oh god that's gonna be terrifying okay we're gonna take the rat and the cockroach in case we ever we ever get to that point hopefully we won't we're gonna look at that north section and i think that's gonna be it for this episode that's not a analog thing. That's a coyote, I think. Also, by the way, for those who are wondering, this icon right here, the moon, is a like rewarding night combat. Basically, when we fight during the night, we get more experience in our weapons. And considering that we are constantly in the dark, I thought it would be fitting. To have it it would be great if one of you had a digital watch you know just saying okay we take a left here i don't want to go through the woods i do not like this okay you know what no it's too risky we're gonna go back home and we're gonna leave the rest of the exploration for the no no we have to go there we have to go there it has to happen we have to we have to we can't give up that easily. Okay, let's go. Oh, Joy, it's four of you. 
Is that a cat? It sounded like a cat. Okay, um... Okay, I would rather not fight it right here. Yeah, okay, this is better. This is better. Get over here. Ow! That's not fair. You just made a loud noise. That's not spooky. That's a jump scare. And jump scares are cheap. <sighs> we can scrap those. Okay. Military boots, military gear. Nothing particularly good. Okay. We're doing it, guys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Keep crying, Bozo. Oh, God. I'm gonna act like they didn't scare me. Because that's what I wanted. Uh, no. It's cool, though. Nah. We're gonna keep going. Uh, there was one more. I know that. I'm sure I saw one more. Where are you? Okay, let's keep on the road. Almost there. It's right behind us. There you are. There you are. That's the one I saw. And that one. Yeah, the fit, the, the foot, foot, foot fetish lady. Yeah, you scream and you die. I said you die. I said you die. I said you die. I said you die. And you too. Another one. Ooh, two more. Oh, she's thick. Oh, brother, she's thick. She's thick. Don't come for me. Please. Please don't. Anyone behind me? No. Oh, my God. Whoa, whoa, whoa. This is... I don't know about you guys, but damn, this is very spooky. You have something on you. A hand fork. Okay. Here comes another thicker. She thick, she thick. Oh, there's more. One behind us. Okay. Please fall over. There you go. You died quickly. Please don't scream at me. Whoa. Okay, short play. Thank you. <laughs> it's funny because, like, we have these terrifying noises, then the level up screen is like, ping, 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 ping. <laughs> uh, it's fine. It's fine. Okay, we're almost there. We're almost there. The last place we're gonna check for the day. Okay, almost there. Almost there, guys. Here it is. Here it is. We got here. Yeah, as expected, there are sets inside. There you are. I see you. Will the red coat lady come out to play? There you go. Uh, I like your coat. That I will tell you. Yeah, your red coat is very pretty. Uh, other than that, nothing. Now, the house is dangerous. We have to be careful. There's a dead one there. Oh, a, a child thing. Okay, let's see, let's see, let's see. Nothing, nothing, nothing. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, we get a hammer. That's good. Another screwdriver. It's another weapon. A dead zombie. That's always great. Always great seeing them dead. And not moving at all. Herbalist guide. That that could actually be pretty good. Maybe. I don't know. Oh. Ooh. Is this? <gasps> a gun. All right. All right. All right. We don't have a holster though. But it's okay. We're going to keep it here. We're going to take the ammunition. Okay. 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 We got a gun. We might use it sometime. Not sure when. But sometime. We also have another dead zombie. We have a military sweater. This is good. Yeah, let's wear it. Uh, wherever it is, I'm sure it's warm. Let's close this. Okay. Uh, what do we have here? Bathroom. Good. Always nice to see. 
Uh, we have some food here, don't we? We have soup! Let's drink the soup! You know what? I'm gonna drink this soup too. Because it's gonna go bad soon. Drink, drink, drink. Yummers! Okay, we drank the soup. We're gonna take the cooking pot to our house. And the bowl too. Uh, the water bottle, yeah. Water bottle is a commodity. Oh, maybe we can't reach it. Ooh, that's a knife? Yeah, the knife is good. Hello. Then we're gonna take this knife. Because weapons are really important. Okay, is there a second floor? No, right? No, it's a single floor. Okay, anything else around here? There is a little shed. Let's check it out real quick. Right before going back home. Where's the shed? Right there. Oh, that was that was terrifying. I hate that there are so many trees. Really, you have no window. No window. No window. Okay, we're going back home. Uh, we checked enough. Uh, we're going back home and then we will plan what we do next. We go back upstairs, we close the door. Oh my god, that's terrifying! Oh, okay, uh, that'll do for this episode. Um, we're gonna try to figure out what we do next. We're probably gonna hit up this area around here to get some weapons or maybe even go to the factory. Uh, we'll think about it. For now, we're gonna stay here. Uh, this place is pretty much safe. So yeah, that'll do for this episode. Thank you all for watching. Please subscribe if you want to see more. I'm gonna keep doing this one and the Louisville Rooftop Challenge. They're gonna be simultaneous. So thank you all for watching. Uh, have a good one. Bye bye Previously on 30 Nights of Horror. Open the door. Open the door. Please. Open the door. I'm hurt. Open the door. 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 Uh, do we have our flashlight? Yeah, we do. Uh, hello, guys. Um, welcome back to the um, the Thirty Nights of Horror Challenge. Woo! Yeah, baby. <laughs> yeah, welcome back. Welcome back. Uh, hello. Hi. Um. So yeah, this is the sixth attempt. Hopefully, this is the one. <laughs> yeah. Hope. Hopefully, this is the one. <laughs> Oh, we've been attempting this so many times, like, everything is going wrong. Everything that could go wrong is going wrong. Every single time, like, we're just dying over and over and over again. Oh my god. Okay, you have a battery. Uh, give that to me. Uh, yeah, just, just uh, everything is going wrong. Hopefully this one is different, though. <laughs> Hopefully. Okay, great, at least we have... We're in Muldrow again, aren't we? Uh, no. Where is this? Okay, this is not Riverside, is it? It might be Riverside. I don't know. 
We'll see. We'll see. Yeah, we don't have the map unlock. We have um, a couple of stuff, you know, like, um, yeah, I, I just, I just, you know, yeah. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, guys. It's just like I've been trying this for so long. You have no clue. You have no idea how many times I've been trying this. Uh, I told you five, but it feels like way more than that. Uh, hopefully this one works. If it works, then I'll explain the challenge again. Oh, another flashlight. That's good. But we're just gonna take the battery. Uh, yeah, now we have three batteries. That's... that's good. We just need to survive now. Okay, yeah, so horrors beyond our comprehension. That's great. Uh, toy flashlight. Let's remove the battery. Uh, crayons. That's great. Better than a pen. Uh, a car key. Okay, okay. Jax the paper and Fifi the flamingo. Oh, and the toy bear. Fifi the flamingo. You have to come with us. You are a little bit too big, but we'll take you too. If we need to drop you, I'm sorry, but Jax, you're the least important one. I know, I know that breaks your heart, but... It, it is what it is, you know? Sometimes we just draw the short end of the stick. Oh, it is- No, it's a bug. Bugs are... Not very good. Okay, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. What do we got? A doll... Yeah, this is just... <gasps> Cherry Spiffo! We're not gonna take you, though, but we're gonna remember that you're there. Uh... <gasps> Molly the Mole! Okay, that's enough. I, I, I can't take that many. Come on! Okay, we're gonna take you here. We're gonna actually move you over here. We have a baseball bat, but we can't really use it properly. <gasps> Blueberry Spiffo! Yeah, we can't use that. We... Santa Spiffo! Rainbow Spiffo! Okay, we gotta take Rainbow Spiffo. We, we, we gotta. We have to take Rainbow Spiffo. You know, you know how rare Rainbow Spiffo is? He's incredibly rare. We're gonna take just like all the batteries we can find. And in other batteries, battery. Another battery somewhere around here. No more, okay, that, that's enough batteries. Okay, there's a zombie around here. Oh, no, wait, where are we? I'm not sure where we are. I've never seen this place before. This is not from a mod, is it? Oh, oh, it's a police officer? Ma'am, are you here to arrest me? I apologize, but I will not comply. Can you die? Can you die? Thank you. Do you have something on you? A key? Okay, we'll take that. Uh, bulletproof vest. Okay. How many holes did it have? Hopefully not. Eh, it had a couple, like one hole. Okay. A uh, holster. That's actually huge. Some glasses, shoes. We can actually rip this. Okay, yeah, we just want some bandages. We don't need that. Uh, let's take this, let's take this. The batteries, let's put them here. Yeah, actually the batteries, we're gonna put them in the pockets. Leave this area as clear as we can. We're gonna take the keys there. Okay. How are we battery-wise? 76%, okay. Remove broken glass. Okay, so far so good. Definitely better than other times. <laughs> Yeah, you're, you're a little bit asleep. Why are you guys Jesus Christ? You shouldn't be there. That's illegal. But it's fine. Two holes. Uh, let's rip this. Okay. okay, okay, okay. We have a couple here. Okay. We're doing pretty well. Actually, this is water. We can wash them here. Okay, so I can wash myself. Well, maybe it's because it's tainted. Yeah, okay, you know what? It makes sense. Guys, I understand. You don't like me here, but... You're not gonna do anything about it. You're in the water. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You keep saying about it. I can feel the garden. Whatever. Whatever. Nobody cares. Some ammunition. That's great. We're gonna take that. A walkie talkie, matches, Louisville map, Louisville map. Uh, we can. Adhesive uh, bandages. They're not that great. Actually, adhesive bandages, if I'm not mistaken, are the... Ooh. Okay, so we can't check the... We can't check the trunk. That sucks. The car is too far up. Oh, it's fine. 
So yeah, what what is this place? I don't recognize this place at all. I've never seen it. Mm. Is it in Riverside? I think it might be. For now, let's keep checking the surroundings. Anything here? Nothing too useful. Those are boxes, but they're not like actual boxes. Okay, the key works for everything here. No zombies around the area. Hello, sir. Do you have anything good? Oh, oh, this is good. Okay, yeah. Now we're warmer. Okay, we have some books here. More toys. Jacks the Beaver again. A lot of Jacks the Beaver. <gasps> Pancake the Hedgehog. Freddy the Fox. Okay, you're spoiling me right now. <gasps> Fluffy Foot Bunny. Okay, enough. <laughs> this is gonna become like um. A full-blown plushy, <laughs> plushy video, and we don't want that. <laughs> Why are there so many toys here? Is this? This doesn't seem like a. <gasps> Throw it. Okay, enough. <laughs> enough. Stop. Stop it. <laughs> we need to focus on surviving. No, it's Otis. And get out of here, Otis. Get out of here. Gosh. <laughs> Stop. I can't help myself. I'm sorry. <laughs> Okay, okay, okay. Let's keep checking the surrounding area. We might make our base right here. We do have some stuff to survive with. Okay, let me start using this bar. I think it's better, right? Slightly better damage. No, I think it's the same damage, but I think this one... Oh! Hey, um... Would you guys like to come in here? I would like to fight you in a place where I know I'm not gonna get jumped. Hello. Hello. Okay, no, it's single target, but it's fine. Wait. No. I'm not gonna wait. You wait. Why would I wait? Hello. Okay, they're having a, a munchies. Okay, there's are two? Yeah, there are only two. I can deal with two. Eh, I'm still using the hammer. I thought I was using the other one. Okay, uh, fall down. Nice legs. Let's use this one. Uh, anyone else around here? Not really. A lot of cars. Uh, I did not expect this many cars. Uh, farming beginner. I don't think. I don't think we're gonna be. Oh really? Sorry about that. I I got a little call. Uh, really, we scratch ourselves with a with a tree. Really, a tree. Oh my god, I I hate that. I hate that trees can... Yeah, wait, this is a cactus. Like, where, where the hell did a cactus come from? That's weird. Okay, so this is a bike. Oh, this is the car we got the key from. Okay. Do you have any gas? Nope. Empty. That's fair. Anything? Anyone else? I don't see anyone. Okay. Please don't scratch yourself again. Uh, battery. Plastic bag. Okay. This is just a big barricade. I think this might be Riverside. Just changed from the 10 years later mod. It might be. Let's keep checking the insides of this area. We already checked this part. Let's have a look over here. We still need food. Like, we desperately need food. Oh yeah, it's you guys. Yeah, sure, you keep you can ping you. Uh, on barricade. Smash the window. Remove broken glass. We go in. Nothing flashlight we're gonna remove the battery as usual batteries are incredibly important in this challenge uh, okay some water you actually have a lot of water but i don't think so i'm gonna see if i can find the sink okay okay there we go just what i was picking out okay you go here you go here i think we can make a yeah bind scissors to pipe we attach it to our back there we go we have a solid weapon now uh, let's fill the empty bottle, because this one actually only takes one spot. Okay, so far so good. Let's replace the bandage with ripped sheets. Okay, great, great, great. Let's clean that bandage, actually. Okay, doing good. Is this just water? Yeah, it is. Okay, I can't go there. Anything here? No sets. Uh, another pipe. Let's actually take the time to read our magazines. So we can drop them. Uh, 
anything else we can do in here? No. Okay. Pencil, toothbrush, zombie. With more leather strips. Leather strips are useful so we can use... We can make more weapons with them. Anything in here? You actually probably have a battery. Yep. We don't really get the... Whatchamacallit... The helicopter event, so we don't really need... We don't have a use for radios. So far, so good. This is the best we've gotten so far. Hopefully, we can see this one through now. We did spawn in a very good location now. Uh, the file would be useful, but I don't want to... There's a set nearby. Where are you? Oh, this is a break room. Okay, okay, okay. Do we have something good? Coffee. Coffee is always great. Helps with fatigue. Tea bag, also great. Sadly, no, you know, actual food. Oh, a can of oats. That's huge. Another can of oats. We might have to eat. Okay. How were we weight wise? Okay, we're at 80, so we can ration this. Let's eat half. Yeah. Okay, 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 all right. Okay, we're, we're saved for a bit. This is the bathroom, isn't it? No, it's a storage closet with nothing inside. Okay. Let's see. What do we have here? Hello? Ah, there. Here comes one. Ah, okay, they're hitting the... the door. Anyone in here? No one in here. They are hitting it pretty hard, but it is barricaded, so... Should be... Oh, we ran out of... Flesh. Is there anyone here? No. Okay, wow, they're hitting this pretty hard. Gonna have to open it. Oh, that was close. Yeah, we have to deal with them. I don't want that door breaking down. Okay, okay. Oh, oh, oh. Wrong side. Okay. It's okay. We got the window now. Okay, great. Don't fence launch me. That's exactly what I told you not to do. Fall over. Hey, wait, 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 stop. Oh! Okay, 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 okay. This is bad, this is bad. This is no buen- Ooh, you're fast! You're a speedy one! But you're also fragile, apparently. Miss, please fall over. Okay, Mr. Tootsies. Well, it looks like you only have like four left foots, huh? <laughs> Please kill me. Okay. Uh, did the other one? Oh, there you are. Hello, gentlemen. Please fall over and die. Okay. Whew, gosh darn it. A lot of corpses here. Okay. There's another one here, right? No, I think it's those ones. Yeah, they're still making their noises. Okay, 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 okay. We're okay. For the time being, anyways. I don't see anyone. I see a bicycle. Nothing else, though. God damn, it's so dark. Okay, of course you're locked. Why wouldn't you be? Uh, do you have anything on you? Um, West Point map. We can read that. Where are you? There you are. Read. Uh, walkie talkie. Actually, you have... Nah, I'm not gonna keep you. I was gonna say I can take the battery from you, but... Yeah, maybe we should. Yeah, we definitely should. Okay, I think we're decently okay in terms of weapons now. Oh, a uh, gas can. That could be very useful. We don't have much space, though. Oh, no, we, we do. We just need to rearrange a little bit. We can have our spiffle here. We can have this here. You can be there. Mm. How can I set you up? It only needs a 4x4, four four, so... We can do this, and bam! There we go. Okay, okay, okay. Let's keep checking the area. Do you have anything useful? Sprinting, that's good. Kentucky Herald, yeah, as expected, you have newspapers. 
Uh, duct tape. Duct tape is good. Riverside. Okay. This is what we need. Yeah, we are in Riverside. Okay. So it seems like the river itself swallowed the area. Okay, but that's good because here's the school. We can actually go there now. Okay, that was the plan for the first one before it went to the shitter. So yeah, that's gonna be the plan. But for now, we're gonna stay in this area. We're gonna keep looting. See what- Oh, hello! What are you doing here? Hello, sir! Are you the manager? Uh, pardon me for intruding, I just have a complaint! Oh, oh my god, that, <laughs> that actually scared me. I did not think she, they would be there. <laughs> it's- I don't, I don't know. Do we really care about the gender of monsters? Yeah, we do. Yeah, we do. Uh, okay, okay, everything seems good. There's no sets here. We already read that, we haven't read this one. Okay, yeah, this is definitely going way better than the other five attempts I've done of this. <laughs> uh, this is definitely going better. We are now, like, very close to our initial objective, which is the um, Riverside School. I want to make my base there, because it's good for defenses, and we're gonna need a defensible area. We're gonna need a place we can properly defend for the Horde Knight. Ooh, that looks cool. Yeah, we're gonna need something like that for the Horde Knight, because it's gonna be, as you remember, 300 zombies. That's not a small number, at all. Okay, let's replace the bandage. Okay, 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 so far so good, so far so good. We're getting a bit hungry, but not enough to actually eat. You guys, I hope you're having fun. We can't... Come on, wait, come on. We gotta get up here. Maybe if we... Yeah, maybe if we do this. No, we can't. Okay. That's difficult. Can we climb this without dying? I have a feeling we're gonna die. Let me try through here. Nope, yeah, we would probably die. Yeah, and that's the only way to get there, huh? But it's blocked off. Ah, uh, this car makes things difficult. Maybe there's another way to get here, but I don't know. Oh my god, come on. Uh, it's fine, it's fine. We're gonna have to live with the... I mean, we could dismantle stuff and build a bridge ourselves, but I don't think we're gonna do that. Actually, what we should do right now... Uh, then again, it does it really matter if we, if we don't sleep by 11 p.m.? Well, by 23 hours because let's be real uh let's be real it's always night time so who cares we'll just sleep when we're tired uh, let's remove the broken glass let's actually remove it from both okay anyone around here i still have 55 percent battery okay seems safe there's a bike there but i don't think we're gonna use that there's a door here probably with a set inside There's one in there. A key? Hello? MTB key. There's a set in here. All over? And die. Okay. So far so good. Did you have anything useful on you? No, you didn't. Okay, now let's wait. There you are. Let's keep you in here. There's one there. Yeah, there's one here. What are you? What do you have? Hello! You have like a full-blown juggernaut armor. What the hell? Holy cow! Damn, brother! Damn, sister! You had a full-blown body armor! Whoa! Holy cow! Military Juggernaut Chain Mail Jacket? Whoa! I don't know if we can take that, that's a little bit too heavy for us. Okay, there's two there. No one behind us, so we're gonna take these guys. Oh, there's more over there. Oh, did that one see us? Yeah, 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 they did, they did. Okay, 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 okay. Come here, come here, come here. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Okay. You die 
there. Now you, I'm going to take you down too. Come on, come on. Oh, oh my god, are you... Get, get out. Get, get, get. Okay, 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 it was just a scratch. Ooh, actually our clothing saved us from a bite, I heard it. This vest saved us from a bite. I heard it. Oh, you're, there's two here. Okay. Okay, so far so good. Come on, come on, come on, die. There's one. Now the other. Come on. There you go. Now you. Uh, open. There you go, you fall. Don't scream at me! Okay. <sighs> okay, okay, okay. Uh, where's the broken bar? There you are. We're gonna drop you. We're gonna put this one in here. Okay, 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 okay. There was another one, right? I heard her. Maybe not. Maybe yes. This place is relatively safe. Anyone outside? Okay, everything seems safe. Oh, we could really use a, a safe place to end the episode. You know, some cookie, waffles, rotten, awesome. It's always great to find rotten food. That's exactly what I need, rotten food. Rotten potato, great, great. I love me some uh, rotten potatoes, a rolling pin. I already have better weapons. Uh, do you have anything? Marmalade! Let's go! Woo! Yeah, baby, we found some marmalade! That's gonna be huge. That's gonna be huge. Uh, do you have anything in here? Uh, broken cooking pot, extinguisher, broader knife, nothing too useful. Uh, what about you? This goes to the outside, okay. Uh, already read it, the motor, a metal bar, pliers, okay. We're gonna eat some, like the other half of our roots. Okay, so far so good, we found really good food. Uh, okay, and we are rel- we- we might actually take this armor. We might actually take some of this armor, actually. Just how heavy. It has a hole, which I don't like. This one has no holes, and those are some... Okay, let's see how it looks. Oh, uh, I don't know. I don't know if we want that. Like, sure, we could wear the helmet. Uh, uh. I thought I heard something. I don't know, like, look. I like um, protection as much as the other guy, but um, if we have to sacrifice drip, then no. We are not sacrificing drip. I know, I know, I'm probably gonna die and regret it, but drip is too important, man. It's too important. I wish we could hide the police vest. We have a mod for that, but I guess it didn't take effect. Hopefully next time. Okay, so far so good. Yeah, it seems that Riverside, the river, flooded the entire area. Oh, hey, I think there's more than one. Oh, you're going over here? Woman, where are you? I heard you. 
There you are. Hello, woman. I think you had your fill. What is that? Whoa, whoa, whoa. The trees. Oh, hello. I didn't see you there. Hello. Hello. Okay, there we go. We got them. We got them. Come on, come on. Follower. Oh, you're resilient. You have a lot of natural body armor. Earbuds. Great. Okay, 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 okay. All right, we're doing pretty well. If we can find a place that has a second floor, that would be perfect. Hello? Oh, hi. You have a... Is that a full body dress? Sure, feels like it. Cultist robe and cultist hat. Yeah, that, that makes sense. Oh, there's, uh, there's, there's a bunch there. Five. Size, I would rather not deal with them. But we probably will have to. Okay, here's one. Ooh, I think that one has a good backpack. I think it's a military zombie. Can you stop laughing? Ooh, yeah, that's a big backpack. Hello. Please fall over. Big backpack. Big backpack. Big backpack. And we have that one in. Okay, wow, that's a big backpack. Okay. Okay. All right, we're moving up in the world. Oh my god, I'm so glad we finally got a good recording. Oh, thank goodness. Okay, this is the... Yeah, okay, I think I know where this is. I think the bar might be... Oh, that's, that's, that's a lot more than I expected. Let's go back into the spiffos. Hello, would you like a burger? And some fries. I don't know how to turn that into a joke, but you know you're gonna die. So does it really matter? I don't think so. Bam! What blammo! What blammo! Ba bam! Okay, great, 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 great. Another key. We don't need another key. Uh, what we need to do is replace the battery. Now we're gonna wait until it fully wears out. Ah, uh, okay. Okay, this is um. Uh... Oh, it's barricaded. What are we? What are we getting stuck on? Okay, we are getting tired, so I think... Okay, yeah, this is the clothing shop. We're getting stuck on so many trees that I can't see. It's actually pretty wild. Okay, you know what? I think we're gonna stay here for the night. Or maybe in this office. All right, guys. Well, for now, it seems like we finally got our good recording. So I'm gonna go to sleep and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Please subscribe if you like this content. Just please subscribe. You you have no idea the pain and suffering I've been going through to record this and to record the Louisville challenge. Oh my god, that was hell. Oh my god, all of this was hell. But we finally got a good recording. So please uh, leave a like if you like this series. And uh, I'll see you guys tomorrow, okay? Well, on the next uh, episode. Bye-bye. Oh, I slept with my battery on. I slept with my battery, with my flashlight on. Oh, no. <laughs> uh, good morning, guys. Welcome back to the 30 Nights of Horror Challenge. So yeah, um, I slept with my flashlight on, which is always awesome to do. Uh, but yeah, in the last episode, as you may remember, we actually got a really good recording, finally. And we found a large backpack, which is huge, ginormous. Now what we need to find is a place to sleep. Let's eat a little bit of breakfast in the, form of, in the form of some chips. And let's try to find a home. For now, we had to sleep right here because, you know, things are dangerous. But I think I know we might have to go guaranteed to the school. I think that's gonna be the best bet. But we're gonna loot this area right here. This couple of shops. See if we can find something good. Where are you? Oh, there you are. It seems to be only two. Okay. 
Anyone behind me? No. Hello, ma'am. Thank you for falling over quickly. Very kind of you. Okay. Uh, nothing particularly useful on you. Okay, nothing else. We're gonna remove the barricades from... Unless you broke the door. You did. Good. That makes my job a lot easier. Okay, someone is hitting on a door. Ooh, bourbon. That's good. Bourbon is good. You're gonna be able to be red. Uh, that's an empty bottle. Okay. We could make a kill box with these ones. That would be pretty good. We can make like a couple of kill boxes in case we need them. Do you have something good in you? Just a bunch of rotten food, melted ice cream, margarine. Okay, that's good. That's edible. That doesn't go bad. A scissors. As usual, it's really good. Nothing else. Uh, it's a bathroom. Okay, we can fill our water bottle and clean our bandages. Let's actually replay. Let's remove it. See if we're safe now. Nope, it's still there. Let's replace it. Then let's remove this one. There we go. That one's good. Let's clean them. Okay. We're a okay for now. Oh, hello. No, no, no. Please stay down. Uh, stay down. Thank you. Come on, come on, come on, die! Whoa. There you go, thank you. Okay, our weapon broke. That's no bueno. Uh, yeah, that one. Let's equip the other one. We're gonna need... Uh, more weapons soon. That's why I want to get to the other one, to the left building. Anyone? There's actually a building here, right? Yeah, there is. That one's barricaded. And it's some barricade. Wow. Where? Oh, ho, ho, ho. good thing I moved. Oh, ho, ho. good thing I moved. <laughs> you almost sneaked up on me, you little shitter. My god, you almost got me. Oh, oh that terrified me. Okay, I think they're over there. Uh, let's remove the broken glass. Ma'am, sorry. Okay. So far, so good. Okay, I'm gonna let them be there. Um, anyone in here? No. No, okay. Uh, no one outside? No. Let's see what you got. Hello? Oh, you died with someone in there with you, huh? That's fine. Uh, can we find something good here? Maybe some drip? Uh, one whole baklava... Darth Vader's helmet? Uh, yeah, we, we're not gonna take that. <laughs> Darth Vader's helmet. Uh, some patrol, hair bow, beret. Nothing too useful there. Maybe in here? Some drip? Uh, nothing too useful. Drip? Fitness compression underpants? Uh, nothing too useful. Anything here? No. Anything here? No. We did hear a zombie. Nearby. Anyone? No. No. Okay. Okay, there's a set there. Seems to be the only one. We can take it down. Yeah. He was alone. One of these was a hardware shop. Yeah, this one. Anything good? Anything good? This is our best bet at finding solid weapons and tools. Socks. Why are there socks here? The bleach I understand, but socks? Okay, there's a couple outside. But we seem to be safe for now. Yeah, yeah, there we go. Hand hatchet. A club hammer. A screwdriver. A metal cutter. That's actually pretty good, too. Oh, there you are. Hello, ma'am. Thank you for coming. But we are close for the day. Sir, we are... What, are... what are you doing? Okay, looks like we're gonna have a little bit of a fight here. But okay. For now, we don't have to worry too much about that. They're gonna take a little bit to break that off. Let's just wait for them to do that. Have all day. Jeez, you're taking so long. Oh, the 
Guys, the door is open. Yeah, like, the door is open. Just in case you were wondering. Okay, hopefully you two can die relatively quickly. Yeah, there you go. Now, you two are a bit of an issue. Anyone behind you? Doesn't seem like it. Guys, yeah, the... The door is open. Oh, great! We, um... We ran out of battery at the worst possible time. Come on. Okay, you fall down. There we go. Oh, great! We ran out of battery at the worst possible time. Great. We need to keep an eye out on that. There we go. Yeah, I know. The good thing is that, again, we can't get infected unless it's a bite. So hopefully we'll be able to last a bit longer. Ah uh, yeah, some wrenches, a survival knife, that's actually huge. We're not gonna take all of the weapons, but we are gonna take some of the weapons. And the tools. Like this one, for example, and the crowbar. The crowbar is very heavy. Ah, uh, we, can, we can keep it. Do we have... what can we use as a weapon right now? We could use the hand hatchet. We're gonna use this one for the time being. This place does have a lot of stuff. Yeah. So, round point shovel. Yeah, we can make an axe with this and a spear. Ooh, let's go. All right, all right, all right. Let's make an axe. All right. Where is it? Ah, oh, there it is. Ooh, looks good. It goes on the back. How much damage? Almost half. Same as this one, pretty much. Okay. Another crowbar. Couple of cro crowbars around here. Nothing else. A hand file. A shovel. We can make another axe from that one. We are not making spears. You know how that one went. Uh, we can cut this into wire. We're, we don't need that. Ooh, long metal pipe and long metal bar. That's cool. Uh, wood glue. That's huge. can actually keep that right here. Uh, duct tape, as usual, that's good. Can we keep it with this one? No, we can't, okay. Some nails, that's good too. Ooh, this is actually good. Ooh, this is good. This is really good. Ooh, ooh, this is good, this is good. I'm pretty sure we can uh, unequip, 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 unequip. Yeah, there we go, look at that. Look at that! It doesn't look that great, but... We can actually use two-handed weapons now. Okay, that's huge. That's really... No, wait. Is it? Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, okay, that's huge. That's huge. Yeah, and we can add batteries to this one. Okay, all right, all right, all right. Let's unequip this one for now. We're gonna keep it... Yeah, right there. Okay. Uh, now, we can actually use two-handed weapons, which is really huge. Okay, 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 okay. Things are going well. Things are going really well. A lead pipe, we could probably use that for upgrades later. Uh, okay, we have some solid weapons now. Okay, I'm gonna leave this here, like most of this loot, because I can't carry all of it that easily. Yeah, 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 yeah. We're gonna go check the rest of the buildings and the school. Oh, the only issue with the mining helmet is that it doesn't give me that much light around me. There's still, like, very low visibility, but it's fine. I think I can deal with this. Okay, there's one there. She appears to be alone. Oh, there's another one. I can deal with both of them. Oh, great, I can't see anything because there's apparently a tree there. An invisible tree. Okay, we have our right hand wounded which is oh, what 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 what's going on <laughs> that was weird that was very weird why did i suddenly do that that's a new animation okay okay come on full come on die 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 there you go, there you go, and there you go. Okay, um... Yeah, having this wound right here is not very good. Let's replace and disinfect. Uh, that one, we can just replace it. Okay. Uh, we 
we're gonna eat the other half of our chips and we're gonna keep moving we need to be very careful uh, yeah I think we should make our way to the school right about now oh yeah the map changed so much in the 10 years mod 10 years later hmm. there's more than one yep Oh, wow, that was a complete miss, a complete whiff. Okay, there we go. We got both of you. Okay, we had our clothing. I had a feeling, I had a feeling, I had a feeling. I knew I heard something. Oh, I knew I heard something. I have a, f I had a funny feeling that someone was behind me. Oh my god, okay, 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 okay. Oh my god, there's so many trees! <laughs> so many trees and bushes! Okay, okay, okay. I want to bring them here. Come on, come on. There's four. Which is not ideal, but we will have to deal with it. Come on, come on. Get over here. Okay, there we go. No. Yeah, stay down. Stay down. Stay down. Stay down. You too. Okay, there's another one. There's another one that didn't get inside. There you are. Okay, you're a crawler. That's great. Okay, 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 okay. How much battery? We still have some. Let's go. Mm. So far, so good. So far, so good. Oh my god, the visibility is still so rough, you know? But okay, we have to keep going. We just have to. We have to keep going. Okay. Oh, one behind me. Where are you? Where are you? There you are. Oh my god, why are there... Why are there invisible trees? Like, are you telling me those rocks... Are... The thing that's keeping me? Okay, fall over, please! Pretty sure she had a party hat, yeah. Oh, hello. Ugh. That's not bueno. My god, I can't see anything! So many trees! Okay, that's a house. Oh my god, these rocks. I hate these rocks. Okay. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa that, that got me. I think you saw my... The... <laughs> The twitch of my movement. Oh, that that got me good. Uh, let's clean them. Let's drink some here. Uh, let's replace bandage. Let's replace bandage. Okay, 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 okay. Some antibiotics. We're gonna take them so we can heal faster. Because we do have one of our wounds infected. Okay. Was there any food here? Okay, some food. A can opener, that's huge. Uh, anything else? Another can opener, some tortilla chips, that's good. Okay. Do you have margarine, butter? Nope, just rotten food. Okay. Uh huh. Okay. useful. How much do we have? We still have half of it. Uh, leather bag upgrade. Okay, we need needle and thread, but we're gonna keep it for later. Okay, okay. Anything here? It's a gun case. Okay, we have to take it. Uh, okay, here's the plan. We're gonna move you here. Let's use the pockets. Uh, why do we have a plank? We don't need that. We could potentially take the whole case, right? And then we can keep, like, the shotgun there and the ammunition with it. Yeah. Yeah, that's good. Yeah, we'll do just that. 
Okay, so far so good. So far so good. Where's the door? Yeah, now that I think about it, this place has no door. Just a window. Oh, that's weird. Pry open, now we can just remove the glass. Okay, let's check through here. Uh, a couple of zombies over there. Yeah, that should be the school. Or another house. Okay, the school is down and south. Okay, let's check it. Uh, before that, let's see it, the tortilla chips. Okay, 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 okay. I said, we're right there. A couple. Okay, come over here. Anyone behind us? No. Only you two bosos. Okay, gotcha. Okay, there you go. Uh, die, please. Thank you. Don't scream. Where are you? Where are you? There you are. Did you- did you say Sarah? That's not my name. Oh, getting this wound on our arm is the worst thing that could have happened. Well, not the worst thing, but you know, it's- it's- it's up there. Yeah, these guys usually never have anything on them, so... We're just gonna move on. Okay. Hello! Lady Dimitrescu! Lady Dimitrescu! Hello! Look at that. Yeah, we're gonna take your black rose, we're gonna take this cigarette holder, we're gonna take this... We're gonna take your zombie skin, we're gonna take your dress, we're gonna take your hat, we're gonna take your stockings, yeah, we're, we're gonna take your stuff. Hello. Uh, yeah, okay. We just need to go south. Almost there, almost there. Anyone around? No, no, it seems to be okay. My god, fucking trees. Okay, now going here. Okay, we're inside. This is the school. Okay, 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 okay. Now let's just clear it out. There's one over there. Anyone behind me? No. Okay, there's three. So far. If you could uh, fall over, that would be awesome. Thank you. On, fall over or at least like synchronize yourselves you know okay okay great 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 we got you please stop screaming at me Whew. okay okay a, a, a key great that's actually good okay okay there's another one here hello sir oh there's another one she went upstairs for some reason that's good Come on. There you go. Now, we step on you, and you die. Great. Okay, one went upstairs. There you are. Is there anyone else with you? Doesn't look like it. I don't know if they're upstairs or behind me. There's one. I think they were upstairs. Could you fall over? Thank you. Okay, great. Come on, die, die, die. Die, die, die. Ooh. Oh, hello. Okay, there one. Come on, come on, come on. Die 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 What are you? I do not want to damage your outfit actually. Yeah, this outfit actually looks really good. What are you? Die! Oh my god, you guys are so resilient. Okay, what do you have? A hazmat suit. Uh, and it's very damaged. Disappointed. What's in here? Ooh, a lot of tools. Okay. But before that... Why? Another one. What? Was it like... Did I come in a school day? Pardon me. I... I thought school was cancelled. Jesus. Why are you guys here? Can you die? Anytime now. 
Come on, please. <laughs> Come on, please die. Oh my God. Oh my God, you're so resilient. There you go, maintenance. Hello, thank you. Okay, please tell me there's no one in here. No, it's empty. Just a couple of corpses. Empty? Empty. Good. Empty? Empty. Good. Okay, okay. Oh, I really need to rest here. Okay, we made it to the school though. This is great. Let's rest for a little bit. Oh, okay. It ran out. Insert a battery. There we go. Okay, anything here? Uh, soap? We can wash ourselves. Uh, some melted ice cream, which is rotten. I do not want to eat that. Uh, we do have some coffee, but I don't know if I want to use that. Okay, let's keep checking the area. Hopefully we can clear this area and claim it. I think there might be some upstairs. There's one there, definitely. She's, um... Yeah, she's, uh, I don't know if she's sitting or if she's doing something different. Yeah. Um, I'm, I'm gonna stop that because I don't think YouTube... Uh... Oh, I heard you, motherfucker. I heard you, you son of a bitch. Oh, you thought you could sneak on me, huh? Ooh, wow, that was a, wow, that was a wild mess. Here she comes. Or not, I guess. There you go. You die. Okay, she's over there. Whoa, what? Okay. Pull over. Pull over. Stop screaming if you're not coming for me. They scream so much. Yeah, 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 yeah. You keep screaming. Why? Why? There you go. You shouldn't be able to move if I'm above you. one hello ma'am yeah 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 you like screaming I get ya okay there's another one. Oh, you almost got me please die there's another one coming oh my god yeah there's three there's three okay Sarah. Okay. I am not Sarah, but sure. Okay, there we go. Please die. Oh my god, I'm already tired. Okay. We're going back to the... To this area. Oh my god. Okay. Whew. Uh, plan B. Plan B. We're gonna pick this up. No, we're gonna pick this up. And we're gonna place it right over here. And we're gonna sleep right here. Yeah, we should be perfectly safe. Yeah. Okay, so we're gonna... we're gonna go to sleep. And I'll see you guys in the morning. Hmm... Yeah, I think I'm queasy because I'm... Um, oh, because I have an infected one, maybe? Either that or corpse sickness. Yeah. Because if I was infected, I would have a lacerate. No, I would have the anxiety model. So yeah, I think it might be corpse sickness. Okay. The best way to deal with this is by having a hearty breakfast. But we can't do that because our food is limited. So we're gonna have half of this. Go, there we go, there we go, there we go. How's our attack speed? Still trash. That's great, but actually, uh, if we equip this one on secondary, yeah, it's way faster on my secondary because we don't have that one damaged. So, okay, we found our way. 
Okay, let's keep going. Okay, hello guys. Welcome back. We did it. We did it, finally. Oh, that took a bit. That took a bit, and by a bit I mean a long while. But we did it. Oh, we secured the building. We secured it completely. Oof, oh my god. Now we're safe on the second floor. Oh, we secured the school. Now we're safe, they can't get to us. Oh my god, that took a while. Oh, okay, okay. Oh, I really hope you enjoyed. <laughs> oh my god, okay, we got a home. We got a home, we finally, we're finally moving up in the world. Oh, okay, now for the next episode, we'll see what we can do. Um, what I'm planning is that we're gonna, like, loot around the area, secure it. Uh, we'll see, we'll see. For now, we did it. Uh, before you go, let me go here. We are Heather Mason, as you already know. And our traits, you can see them right around here. Yeah, we're unemployed, you know, these things. We have killed 86 zombies. And we have survived for 2 days and 18 hours. Pretty much 3 days. Oh my god. Whew. Also, we found this Spiffle flashlight and we can actually attach it to our belt. So we don't need the mining hat anymore. Um, yeah, we can actually uh, unequip with that. Yeah, we can go back to our good old trip. So yeah, uh, we found some baseball bats and all that. Uh, yeah, uh, thank you guys for watching. Please subscribe if you enjoy this content. And if you like this, also leave a like. That would mean the world to me. It shows me that you like it and it motivates me to keep going because this Oh my god, this series were so hard to make. So yeah, um, thank you guys for watching. Have a good one. Bye bye Thank you. I am free. Do you want to be my friend? Hello everyone, and welcome back to the 30 Nights of Horror Challenge. So, as you remember from the last episode, we secured the area. Let's go. Everything is safe now. Now that we have a safe place to call our home, allow us to mark it down. Now that we have a home, we can start thinking about what we're gonna do. Because, as you may remember, we have to survive for 30 days, well, 30 nights, technically. But that's not it. We also need to think about the fact that on the 30th night, we're gonna get a horde night. Basically, 300 zombies are gonna come to our location and try to murder us. So we have to survive that, and for that, we're gonna need to prepare properly. So we need to start thinking about what our objectives are and what we need to be prepared for that. We have a small list of our objectives so we can properly prepare for the Horde Knight. First of all, we're gonna loot the surrounding area. That means we're gonna loot the houses around Riverside and loot these sections to find multiple things. Basically, we're gonna mainly loot around the houses. Uh, because these areas actually have a lot of zombies, even though we came from them. But 
our main focus right now is gonna be the houses. We're gonna find food and water, first of all, so we can have proper food and water to survive those 30 nights. After that, we're gonna find weapons, building materials, and tools. For that, we're gonna loot the hardware store that we found over here. After that, we need to find a generator and a generator magazine. The generators would probably be in these sheds, that's what I'm thinking. Why do we want that? So we can turn on the damn lights. <laughs> we can't live in darkness all the time. We need our base to be laid up. Then, after that... After that, we need to secure a vehicle. It needs to be either a bicycle or a motorcycle. We will eventually have to find both, like it is an upgrade. But to find the motorcycle, we are also going to need to secure this section. This is a gas station. And we need gas to use a motorcycle and to use a generator. After we secure a vehicle, our objective would be to loot the military surplus store for guns, ammunition, and military gear. That would be found somewhere around here, if I'm not mistaken. We're gonna have to find it. But yeah, it's gonna be somewhere around here. We're gonna need a lot of guns for the Horde Knight. And after that, we're gonna fortify the school. We're gonna make kill boxes. We're gonna make bridges to make them fall. We're gonna make barricades, etc. So for now, before we start our plan, we're, I'm gonna loot around the school, at least the second floor, and I'm gonna find all the gear that we can that we can properly use. I'll see you guys as soon as I loot at this section. Hello! <laughs> oh, <whoa. laughs> Okay, um... Hey, guys! <laughs> oh, we... <laughs> we finally got that, so, um... Yeah... <laughs> guys... This... This guy right over here, this, this is our friend. <laughs> this guy is gonna come around every now and then. And keep us on our toes. <laughs> this is SCP-650. Uh, some of you may know who he is. But basically, it's a mannequin. That every now and then decides to appear and say hello. <laughs> he, he loves jump scaring people. It's, it's his hobby. Yeah, we need to be careful. Not to confuse him with an actual zombie. He, he got me that time. I did not expect... I forgot he existed. But yeah, um... Just wanted to update you, this little fella is gonna come every now and then. <laughs> Whew, he got me. <laughs> oh, oh, he's gone. Hello! So, we looted the area now, and I can tell you, we didn't find much, <laughs> but we found some stuff that could be useful. So, we have everything right around here, we found a couple of stuff, some duct tape, some books, we're gonna check the library that is downstairs in a bit. Uh, but yeah, we have a couple of stuff right here as well, some weapons, some books, uh, a couple of planks that we could use to build flooring. Apart from that, we have a gas can, which I don't think we're gonna take right now, but when we start the concept of securing a vehicle, we might need to take that. Uh, some food, some wood glue, you know, nothing too wild. We have a shotgun with some shells. We're not gonna use that just yet, because I don't wanna die. <laughs> so, yeah. Oh, we also 
We could use some bandages, huh? Yeah, we're gonna have to use these ones. Uh, we'll, we'll have them here. We have a couple of batteries, so we should be okay in that regard. We're gonna take Fifi the Flamingo with us. Fifi is gonna keep us safe. That I know. And we have a couple of weapons, a couple of tools. We're also gonna bring some, you know, general tools that we might need. And yeah, okay. Now it's time to look around the area, actually. First of all, I'm gonna read this. So I'll see you once I'm done with it. Well, who would have thought? Uh, reading a whole carpentry book actually takes quite a long time. But yeah, I just wanted to get that out of the way because we're gonna need to build our carpentry levels as much as we possibly can. Now what we're gonna do is we're gonna loot around the rest of the area, the houses mainly. Hey, Editor Nebula here. Welcome to Nebula's VoiceOver, where I, future Nebula, explain and summarize the long and tedious section of the video. As mentioned before, I left the school to loot the surrounding houses, looking for any useful loot I could find. I also took the opportunity to loot nearby cars, which didn't have much, honestly. One highlight was when I found a big container in the middle of the former street, which was locked. But I made a mental note of its location, since I knew for a fact that it would definitely have some solid loot. It has to, right? While looting, I found a couple of locals who were a little bit too friendly. After disposing of multiple bozos, I kept on looting, finding... stuff, I guess? Uh, yeah, the houses were clearly a bust. At best, I found a couple of cans of food, some cooking utensils, a couple of guns, not that great. It was at this time that I realized I would not survive if I relied on houses, so I decided to take a bigger risk to catch a bigger fish. Walking down the path east, I came across the parking lot, multiple cars with nothing of value, as usual. I did find a bike, which I took for a spin for a solid three seconds. After that joyride, I found the Gigamart, and since we are playing on the 10 years later mod, it was a fortified version of it. As soon as I entered, I met my first obstacle, the Chef. After sending the Chef back to the kitchen in the sky, I went to the main section and came across the customers looking to steal my bargains from me, so I had to Black Friday them. With all the killing said and done, I finally got to looting, and boy oh boy did I find some good loot. Yeah, a sledgehammer, just laying there, waiting for me. Apart from that super duper rare item, I also found food. A lot of food. And a trolley which I promptly used to bring all of my ill-gotten gains back to my base. With food and water secured, it was now time to obtain more weapons. Remember that container I spoke about? Yeah, we found a bobby pin during our travels. And with said bobby pin, we were able to open the container. It contained exactly what we needed. That's such a cool thing. Oh, nice, no, just what I wanted. Multiple axes. Arguably the best weapons in the game. Uh, feel free to fight the crowbar versus axe debate in the comments down below. We also took the liberty of looting the hardware store again to get the weapons we left before. With food, water, and weapons secured, it was time for our next objective. Turning on the beacon 
of hope. Yeah, it sounded better in my head. Anyways. We set out on a journey to loot the surrounding sheds, looking for the Fable Generator, a tool rumored to be able to generate power of the light kind. We first checked the eastern sheds, finding absolutely no generator. Awesome. But it wasn't a full bust. We found a propane torch. That, combined with the welder's mask we found in the hardware store, meant we could potentially enter the metalworking area. Awesome! While traveling south to check the sheds, we were met with our first true horde, and let me tell you, it went about as well as you expect. Okay, yeah, we should be near the school now, so we should be safe here. After taking down the horde and licking our wounds, we kept going finding more stragglers looking to sell us their cooking pots. Seriously, why were there so many zombies here? Are, are they also chasing the Fable Generator? With all killing said and done, we checked the Southern Shed, and we found... That's a generator. Awesome. Yes, we found it! So we took it, and we booked it back home. With the generator in our hands, we finally had everything we needed to turn on the beacon. Right? Well, not exactly. Because this is where things got difficult. You see, to operate a generator, you need something else. The bane of every Project Zomboids player's existence. The single most infuriating item to find in the game. Yes, even worse than a sledgehammer. While I spent my time looting around the area, I made sure to check every single bookshelf, every side table, every place where a generator magazine could spawn. And I found nothing. So I decided to take a risk and loot the biggest book sections in Riverside. Apart from the school, which, spoiler alert, had nothing. It was time for us to loot the Riverside bookstore and the Riverside Mail Service. But there was a problem. Remember episode 3? Yeah, the bookstore and mail service are on the other side of the river that now crosses Riverside. I guess we should call it River Inside now? Why aren't you laughing? There is a bridge, however. You may remember that the cops decided to lock that down. This meant that we needed some... outside help. With this new mod, we would be able to push cars using some of our stamina in return. With the proper preparations done, we set out on our journey to push the police cruiser, finding two returning friends along the way. With a couple of pushes and a bunch of rests, and a full night of sleep on an empty stomach, we forgot to pack lunch. We finally opened up the way, and were able to cross the river, all while getting constant cheers from our two greatest fans. Now it was time to check the bookstore, right after a small snack spits up. We checked every single bookcase in the bookstore. Surely one would have the mag, right? <laughs> Wrong. Not a single generator magazine. So we went further up to find the mail service, passing the Riverside Hotel and fighting off a bunch of semi-naked horny dudes. Leave a like if you like bitch dudes harassing you. Just just leave a like. Nobody likes that, but it helps the algorithm. With the bitch bros dealt with, I got inside the Riverside Mail Service to claim my hard-earned reward. Surely 
the mag has to be here, right? Wrong! No mag. No magazine. No generator. No god. Nothing. With this, I realize life is not fair. Life cheats on you. Life hates you. So what do we do when life hates us and cheats? We cheat right back. Okay, we didn't exactly cheat. We just, you know, got a mod which removed the RNG from the generator usage. With this mod, we are able to learn how to connect generators with the right electrical level as it should be in vanilla, might I add. So now we just had to get back home, say hi to our adoring fans on the way, and find all the electrical scrap we can find to improve our electrical levels. We already had a mod that allowed us to tinker with electrical devices, so using the electrical scrap to improve our electrical knowledge by tinkering on a nearby TV, we managed to get to level 2, more than enough to finally connect our generator. Now, I'll give it over to Video Nebula to finish this up. Okay, okay, alright, 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 so we got electrical level 2. Hopefully, that should allow us to operate the generator. And if it does, then we're gonna be able to light the beacon of hope. Yeah, that sounds very cheesy, I know, but still, it sounds cool. Cheesy, but cool, right? I, 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 I think it sounds cool. Okay, okay, I, I just think it sounds cool. We're gonna see, we cleared the area, the surrounding area, but as soon as we turn it on, we're probably gonna get a couple of sets, like the surrounding sets, that they and they will come to our base. So we have to be ready for that. Okay, let's see, let's see, the moment of truth. Come on, big money. <gasps> there we go. We can connect it. Oh God. Oh my god, it's connected! Oh god! Okay, okay, and we have a car with a lot of fuel, okay. The, the moment of truth, guys. The moment of truth. Let's go! Oh my god! Okay, uh, generator info. Let's just see how much. Blue fridge, that's all. Great! So if we turn this on... There we go, we got light! We got lights! Let's listen first. Any sets? I don't hear any. We got light. We got light. Oh my god! Oh, there's the light switch. Yeah. Many. Many. Okay, I guess that one doesn't work in particular. There was another one here, right? Yeah, 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 there is, there is, there is. Can we... Okay, we're gonna jump. Ooh. We're gonna turn this one. There we go! Oh my god! Okay, okay, okay. It's okay. Guys! Look! We got light! We got light in our base! We did it! <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Oh my god, and look at this. Look at this. We can turn on the TV. Oh my god. We did it, guys. We have light. <laughs> oh my god, this took so long, but that's awesome. Oh, it feels so good to finally be able to see without a flashlight. We have light. Oh my god. Okay, guys. Oh, that'll be it for now. We finally have light in our base. That marks a milestone. Let's see, what did we achieve now? We found food and water. We also... Uh, there's a smaller mark here. Uh, make it smaller. There we go. We also found weapons. We found a generator. And we can operate it. Okay, so next episode... We're gonna secure a vehicle, a bicycle and a motorcycle. 
so that we can use them to loot the military surplus store, which should be somewhere around here. I'll try my best to find it. But yeah, that'll be it for this episode, guys. Thank you all for watching. Please leave a like if you enjoyed, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye. Hello everyone, and welcome back to the 30 Nights of Horror Challenge. So, as you remember, in the last episode, we turned on the lights. Pretty cool. So, now that we have the lights on, as you may remember from our plan, I'm just trying to keep an eye out. Oh, hello. Okay, well, you, you know what it says. Okay, so as you may remember, now we have to secure a vehicle because we are gonna hit up the military surplus store. Which, by the way, I thought it was around here, but apparently I I cheated a little bit, I guess you could say. I checked the an outside map and it's actually more around here. So yeah, it's gonna be... I think it's gonna be easier. Because like, yeah, the military surplus store is over here, I think. But there, we can also go to New Doe, I believe it's called, right around here. Which also has a gun store. Well, a farming supply store, that has guns. But for now, we're gonna focus on obtaining a vehicle. That's gonna be our objective for the day. I did find a bike. I do remember... Where did I leave that? I think I left it in the parking lot, right? Not the parking lot of the school, the parking lot for the Gigamart. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I did. Man, I wish there weren't so many trees, you know? Using a car would be so much more convenient. Hmm, there we go, this one. Yeah, I, rem I remember it was green. Yeah, it has like two baskets, which aren't that big, but they still work. Uh, yeah, and it has a light. Okay, time to plan. Okay, we pause that. So, as we know, the location I want to hit is in the middle of Riverside and Rosewood, somewhere around here. Uh, what I know is that we have to take this route and follow this street, this highway, all the way down, never turning except somewhere around here where we're gonna turn to the left. Or I suppose we would just keep going forward. And then we should hit New Doe, I believe it's called, or Dixie, as it was called before. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, should be... Uh, should be easy, right? Simple enough. Surely this is not words set before... Disaster. Was that a tree or was it the car? Uh, okay. Oh, it is difficult to maneuver. Oh god. Oh, that was a tree. Okay, yeah, uh, um. I don't think we're gonna make it, guys. <laughs> there are just so many trees. Where? Ah, there's a couple. I can deal with you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You like screaming. Get a room. I don't know why you would get a room for screaming, but you know. Uh, to each their own. Thank you. Very kind. Nice, one point on axe. There we go. We're quite proficient with axes now. So yeah, um... <laughs> I don't think it's gonna work. I don't think we're gonna be able to get the guns I wanted to get. So yeah, that um... That really complicates things. Okay, let me rethink my options. Hey, so, um, after a lot of thinking, I decided something. We're gonna walk. <laughs> We're gonna walk all the way to Dixie. I can do it within a day. Like, it would take me around a full day to get to Dixie, which I think it's very plausible. Like, our main concern is the fact that we are already on day 13. But if it takes us a full day, it's actually not that bad. Because we still have around half of the time for the challenge. So yeah, I'm gonna walk over there. 
But for that, I'm gonna need to, you know, wait for our next cycle of sleeping. Basically, I'm gonna have to sleep right around here, you know, like chill, get some food, make sure I'm prepared for the journey. So yeah, um, I'm just gonna wait for the next day and I'll see you guys then. Good morning, everyone. So, yeah, it's time. It's time to get on the road. I'll see you guys as soon. Well, I'll see you guys if something interesting happens, which uh, probably it won't. Oh, this recording is gonna be pretty long. Oh, I would love to use this. Whoa, what the fuck? Jesus Christ. There was a tree. Ahead. I don't think we're gonna be able to make this. We haven't even gotten out from Riverside. God damn it! <laughs> okay, um... I wanted to update you... Uh, a little bit ago, but... As you may have guessed, I've been constantly attacked by multiple zombies from all directions constantly so yeah um we're not gonna walk over to dixie we tried and let me tell you we've only found zombies constant fighting constant monsters so yeah that's uh that's not gonna happen instead we're gonna have to rely on our own weapons. <laughs> melee weapons, melee fighting, cunning, strategy, and we're gonna loot around and hope, absolutely hope, that we can find the survivor home or two. That's gonna be our only hope. We're also gonna loot the police station. Hopefully, it's gonna have like a billion guns. Let's be real, it's, it's gonna have like three guns and one box of ammunition uh yeah so i'm gonna start looting and i'll let you guys know what happens Guys, don't tell anyone, but I'm actually gonna have some regular music while I do this, okay? Because this is gonna be a lot of looting. So don't tell anyone, okay? This will be our little secret, okay? Our tiny little secret. guys we found the survivor home look at that oh my god <laughs> hello i mean it doesn't have that much stuff but hey we'll take whatever we can get holy cow yeah nice oh we finally found one. Ooh, civilian bulletproof vest don't mind if i do uh let's just you know um Wear it under everything. Uh, that's, uh, there we go. That's better. Okay, yeah, we don't need this anymore. All right, all right, all right. Well, we found some weapons. Hopefully there's a bit more. Is, is, is there a, a, li a little, a little, there is more military machete. Baseball bat with chain. Okay, another carpenter sex. All right, all right, all right. Okay, 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 okay. Let's just move our stuff around and... Okay, let's let's see if there's mo anything else here. Come on, please. Yeah, combat knife, huge scrap pickaxe. Ooh. 
wee we another one all right all right all right okay 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 we got some solid weapons all right <laughs> all right i'll see you guys in a bit hello everyone and welcome back okay so we looted the entire eh, surrounding neighborhood you know all of these houses this is a propane tank, just in case you were wondering. Uh, yeah, we looted the area, we found some stuff. As you may have seen, we found a survivor home, which had a lot of good stuff, a lot of good weapons. So yeah, with that loading out of the way, I think it's about time we start preparing for the Horde Night. For now, we have survived for 19 days and 2 hours, killing 409 zombies. Pretty good if you ask me, but this also means that we only have 11 days to prepare for the Horde Night, which means that we're running out of time, so now it's about time we prepare this school to be the ultimate kill box. So, to start, I'm gonna take... There's the propane torch. So, what I'm gonna do now that I have my propane torch is that I'm gonna read the metalworking man book because today we're gonna farm the metalworking tree. We're gonna increase our level exponentially because if we do that, we can actually make weapons. More importantly, we can make guns. A double barrel pressure shotgun, handmade pressure pump, Handmade pressure rifle, we can make a lot of things. But for that, we need metalworking, which we're gonna work on building. We can also make pipe bombs, which are also useful. Now that we have read that, we are going to sleep, and on the morning, we're gonna build up our metalworking scale. So I'll see you right after that montage. Ba 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 beep boop wap a blamo bingo nice wa blamo wa blamo what a bingo what a bango wa blamo bingo boom wa blamo bling ba ba boy 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 ka boom nice oh nice sprinting too already level two all right wa ba blamo ba ba boy ba ba boy ba ba boy ba ba boy bingo blam ba bam ba ba boy ba bam ba blam bingo bam ba bam ba boy ba blam Oh my fucking god, you fucking... Hello everyone, as you can see we have a storm outside. So yeah, we made it to level 5. Not bad. So, okay, we made it to level 5. However, we only have six days left it's getting close so the rest of the episode is gonna be us focused on making on reinforcing the school turning it into a true survival kill box so follow me while i show you what we're gonna do first of all for the lower area what we're gonna do is that we're gonna secure well barricade as much as we can barricade all of the entrances with the exception of one of them yeah yeah we're gonna try our best to barricade everything in this case we're just gonna barricade this because this would block off this entire section we're gonna barricade all of these doors all of these areas so that the zombies only get through these two doors that way they're gonna be separated we're also gonna do the same with this one but we're gonna keep these doors completely locked now, I don't think they're gonna be able to come through here because of the fence lines, but it is possible, so we're gonna block all of that off. Also add some, like, furniture and barricades to slow them down. This is gonna be our, f our main kill box section. After that, we're gonna add... Uh, we found some cubicles, but we're also gonna build some fence lines right around here to make multiple kill boxes. Same over here, in this little hallway. We're gonna make a couple of layered kill boxes to make sure that we can slow them down and possibly kill them around there. We're also gonna block this area off. This is a dangerous one because it has a lot 
of windows, which could be quite dangerous, but hopefully we can sl slow them down by blocking this area. We're also gonna block this area, th that door mainly, and this over door, this other door over here. I'm not super worried about this section, but we're still gonna lock them off. We're gonna make another layer kill box right around here. They're probably gonna try to get through those windows, so we should lock them too. Or at least this door. Make another layer kill box here. And once they inevitably get over here, we're gonna go upstairs. We're gonna leave just these two areas down, so that when they try to follow us, they're gonna fall down the holes. That way, we can slow them down. And we're gonna make another kill box right over here. This is gonna be one of our last kill box. We're gonna make one here and another one here, another layer kill box. After that, once everything goes down, we're gonna run over here and we're gonna escape through here. You know, we're gonna jump out from that area. Hopefully, we won't break our legs and we'll just, you know, redo the same thing. So, to start the plan, the process itself, we're gonna need some materials. So, I'm gonna loot around. We can also make fence lines. Rough fence lines, but they are still useful. No, we... Yeah, we can, we can. We just need wood. Okay, so I'll see you guys in a bit. Hey guys, so, uh, <laughs> yeah, we're done. Uh, this, this little fella scared us again. Oh my god. But okay, yeah, we're done. We got our defenses ready. I'll give you a little tour of what we did. Okay, this is the first section. As you can see, we barricaded every single door except for these two. We also barricaded every other entrance from over there. The plan is that some of them will get caught up in this door, we would actually barricade this one too, probably. And then they will get stuck on these barricades, and they will come through here, through this window. While they're getting in, we're gonna be shooting at them from over here, slightly further away. We're gonna be shooting, make killing as many as we can with the ammunition and guns that we kept. After that, they're gonna start coming over here. We're gonna start hitting them as hard as we can with all the melee weapons we got. As they start getting closer, we're gonna be jumping the fence lines and taking as many kills as we can from them. Once they inevitably cross this fence line, we're gonna run back and go over here. We have a secondary kill box. We're gonna do the same. We're gonna start hitting them, hitting them, hitting them. Hopefully, if we have any ammunition, we're gonna be able to keep shooting them. Uh, we have some barricades here. These lead to the library. Hopefully, some of them might get stuck on them. Probably not. We'll see. So yeah, the same plan. We start hitting them as hard as we can. Then we go around, we go around the corner, bam. More barricades. Same deal. Bang, bang. Bang, if we're lucky, some of them will be stuck over there or maybe even try to get inside the library and they will get stuck on those windows. After they inevitably do that, oh, by the way, the um, this little section over here, this section is blocked off because these are other points of entry. Hopefully, none of them will get in through there. Hopefully. Then we keep going, keep going. By the way, I'm doing this movement because I want. If I get hurt, I would love it for to be like right now. Uh, that way, we have time to heal, and most importantly, it gives us more nimble experience. Plus, I want to see how proficient I am at jumping fences. But okay, after they jump that one, we are gonna go to the upstairs area, where we have only two flooring right about here. These two uh, are empty. We're actually gonna try to make a bit more of empty flooring, cutting around the corner so that way they fall as soon as they try to get here. Maybe we'll add some fence lines over there so they jump and they fall. Maybe. We'll think about it. But yeah, this is the next kill box. 
the Yush. They go here, we kill. Bam, 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 bam. We kill them. Here is our second to last kill box. Same deal, you know the you know the drill. And this is our last line of defense. After this fence line, the plan will be once they cross it, we're gonna go over here and we're gonna jump down. It's gonna be our last line of defense. We should be okay jumping just one. Whoop, bam. We jump down. We lose very little HP as long as we're not encumbered. After doing that, hopefully they will all be inside the building, which means that we will be able, it's actually over here, we will be able to go back inside and repeat the whole process. Well, probably. I mean, they're probably gonna try to go downstairs and go over here, so we'll see how it works. If we can't repeat the process, what we can do is just go outside and run the f run away, <laughs> you know, but hopefully, hopefully this will be enough. Yeah, I really hope this will be enough. We will have to fight like hell to get there. But yeah, that'll do it for this episode, guys. We have prepared as much as we could because now we have survived for 27 days and 4 hours, killing 410 zombies a number that will hopefully increase to 710 zombies after the Horde Knight. So yeah, we have three more days, we're gonna wait out those days, maybe make some slight preparations and make sure that we are as healthy and fit as we possibly can. So yeah, I'll see you in the next episode, where we will survive the 30 nights of horror. See you soon, guys. Oh my god, it's almost time. It's almost time to die. Welcome back everyone to the 30 Nights of Horror Challenge. As you may remember, we are about to enter the monster's nest. Or rather, the monster's nest is about to come straight for us. Yeah, you, you, you see this little fella? <laughs> now we're gonna face 300 of them. Very soon. Because we have three days before it hits. So this episode is gonna be the end. We'll see what happens. We did all the preparations we could. All we have to do now is wait the three days and have some last minute preparations. Oh crap, here we go. You can see it on the top right corner. It is time. That icon, in case you didn't know, marks the start of the day when the Horde Knight will hit. It also means that today, at 10 p.m., or I suppose 22, we're gonna be visited by around 300 zombies. I hope our preparations were more than enough. For now, we're gonna relax. We're gonna wait for the Horde Knight to start. I'm gonna make sure that we have all of our equipment. We, we have most of it right here. Allow me to show you what we're gonna use as I make my way back to our room. Basically, we decided to ditch a lot of the stuff that we were about to use. For example, the vest that works as another container. We decided to drop that because it was a bit too heavy. We also decided to ditch a lot of the weapons and all of the other bags, because what we need is to be as light and nimble as we can, so we can properly do this. Without falling and hurting ourselves. What are the weapons that we're gonna take? First of all, we're gonna take a couple of guns. We have two boxes, basically three, 
of 12 gauge shells, which we're gonna use with our shotgun. We're also gonna use an, our M625 and our Rugger P89. Why are we using those and not the ones that we have down here? Because those ones are pretty much the easiest guns to use. At least that's what I believe. And those are the guns that we have the most ammunition of. And let me tell you, we can't carry too much, so we need to be selective. In terms of melee weapons, that's where we're gonna have our most weapons. We have two carpenter axes, one fire axe, which is slightly better than the carpenter axe, one garden scythe, one pickaxe, which in this mod, with this mod, you can actually use it pretty well. Unlike the vanilla one that would hit about as slow as a sledgehammer. Apart from that, we're gonna bring some food, some coffee, raw coffee, a couple of knives, and a couple of magazines, and our trusty water bottle. And last but not least, we're gonna bring the most important item, the most important item in our arsenal, Fifi the Flamingo. Fifi right here will keep us safe. Fifi will protect us. Fifi will show us the way. We're gonna bring him in our bag so, he, so he's nice and comfy. So for now, we're gonna wait until the 22. We still have a bunch of generator fuel, so we don't have to worry too much about that. In terms of flashlight, we're gonna bring this toy flashlight, which, by the way, apparently is better than a military flashlight that we got the other time, so... Yeah, that's, that, that's funny. We have three batteries, which should be more than enough to last us a full day. We have a smoke bomb, which we could use in a pinch, as it pretty much stops the zombies attack. Other than that, we don't have that much. Also, we're not gonna use fire. We could make a Molotov cocktail. However, I decided to put a rule against it, because let's be real. A Molotov cocktail would make this incredibly easy. Like, it would be the easiest challenge in the world if we could just throw a Molotov cocktail. They're all gonna die. So no, we're gonna have to fight them the good old way. We're gonna have to survive with our cunning, with our strength, with our intelligence. So yeah, with that out of the way, I'm gonna wait. We're gonna go to sleep at around 12 p.m., give or take, so we can be ready for the battle during the night and we don't get sleep. So I'll see you guys as soon as we get close to the hour. It's almost time, everyone. One hour left. We're either gonna die a hero or live long enough to see the light of day. Only time and our skill will tell what's going to happen. It's almost time. The time is nigh. The final battle of the 30 Nights of Horror begins... Mm, oh wait, no, it's... <laughs> it's on 22! Oh, silly me! Oh wow, I'm dumb. <laughs> okay, okay, I'll see you in two hours. Now it's about time. The battle, the final battle of the 30 Nights of Horror begins now. It's time to fight, Heather. It is time. Okay, they're starting to hit the barricades. Here comes one. Wow, we have terrible aim. Wow, we have terrible aim, holy cow. Our aim is terrible! I don't think guns are gonna be, I don't think guns are gonna be the answer. But okay, we'll take these ones down. Come on, get over here, bozos! I prepared this just for you. Okay, there go a couple. They're coming in slowly. 
Very kind of them. No one behind us. Our barricades are holding. Here they come! Oh god! Hold! Oh god. Okay, come on, hold. We gotta go, we gotta go. Run out, run out. Actually, one more. Just to be safe. Here they come. What are you doing here? They broke our defenses from the back! Oh no! They broke our defenses! Get over here, you bosos! Hold! Hold the line! Oh god! They broke our defenses faster than I expected! Okay, 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 take out the shotgun, take out the shotgun. Okay. We're loaded. They can't come behind us. That's what I know. Come on! Okay, I'm gonna take you down the old way, because you're the only one who came upstairs for some reason. Oh god, here they come. And our shotgun needs to be on our back. You're not dead. Okay, there you go. You too. Fall down and die! Oh god, they're breaking the barricades! Okay, there we go! One more, one more. Oh god. Okay, time to go, time to go. Next barricade. Oh god, are you shitting me? Okay, we can bandage, we can bandage. It's okay, it's okay. It had to be your leg. Of course it had to be your leg. We're getting tired. Oh god, this is not going well. We're gonna have to ditch. We're gonna have to ditch. It's fine, it's fine. Let's reload, let's reload. Okay. Some of them some of them are gonna come. We're gonna jump down. Oh god, they're already waiting for us down! Oh no, they're smarter than we thought! Wait, let me reload my shotgun. This might be my best gun. Here they come. Oh god! Okay, we have to jump down. We have to jump down. Oh, oh my god, what are you guys doing here? Oh god! Okay, okay, we need to retreat. Tactical retreat. Tactical retreat. We need to rest. They're gonna follow us the whole horde night, so we need to be fast. <laughs> okay, 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 come on, come on. Sadly, the school wasn't enough. And we got hurt, which is terrible. It wasn't our arm, I thought it was our leg. Okay, we need to rest. My god, our endurance is the main problem. And the fact that we are terrible with guns. <sighs> Thankfully we were able to find a, a small bit of respite. Oh, 
we'll have to use the fence lines here. We're still not okay. Oh god. We should have trained more. One month wasn't that much time. Okay, and it was a right forearm, wasn't it? Now that I think about it. Okay, we have to switch now. Okay, okay. Rest. Okay. We're back in the saddle, guys. Time to go. We need to take them down. We can't run away forever. Where are you? Where are you? I can hear you. You want a piece of meat, don't you? Come on! Come on, Boso! Why are you not hitting her? Okay, okay, we didn't get hurt, we didn't get hurt. That's fine, that's fine. Yeah, for some reason she refused to attack her with our melee weapon, but it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Okay, 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 okay. Just need to fight them like this. We got them right where we want them. Okay, time to switch weapons. Okay, we're actually gonna drop the shotgun. It's kind of useless. We're already losing. Our stamina is terrible. Getting hurt right on our forearm was honestly the worst thing that could have happened. Oh god, did we really have to get hurt here? Did it really have to be the right forearm? I would have preferred to be hurt in the leg. Oh god. Okay, we still got some time. Thankfully, they don't chase you the entire Horde night. So we can run away, take breaks and then go right back to killing. We're probably gonna have to eat some coffee too. I'm gonna eat this whole thing. Think, hopefully, our arm is gonna be healed relatively soon. We're gonna have to keep fighting with this one. Where are you, bozos? We need to take the next bunch. Okay, here comes another one. Come on! Come on, bozo! Show me what you got! Aloha! Yeah, she had a couple of, you know, Hawaiian flowers, so that, that that's why I said that, yeah. Okay. Okay, here they come. Here comes another bunch. Here comes another group. Come on, bosos! Holy fight for axe thrower, let's go! What? What? <laughs> Excuse me? <laughs> Wait, but the weapon broke, how can I still use it? <laughs> no, yeah, it, it's, it's broken, it's broken, let's drop it. Uh, I'm gonna put you right here. We have another one, uh, right here. Okay, third one. We're still really slow. Oh, here they come. Come on, Bosos! It's time to fight! Why do you refuse? Yeah, I can't attack on the ground with my secondary weapon, which really sucks, but it's fine. We should take the opportunity and take a break. There we go. Back out. Now our objective is to retake this school. Make sure you, we kill every single zombie that came there. Stop screaming! Ooh, okay. Ah, uh, that, that's, that, that's a strat! Yeah, that's a strategy. Just step on her and she falls to the ground. Okay, let's go! Let's see, how many are in here? A couple, a couple. Probably like 30, 40. 
Okay, maybe we can actually go back to the fence lines. That would be great. Okay, here comes one. No. Oh god! It's fine! Ow! Okay, 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 it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Where did we get hit? Okay, we got beat on our right forearm. Oh, great, the one that was already damaged. Great! I didn't want to use two-handed weapons anyways. It's fine, it's fine. All we have to do is survive. After this horde of zombies is taken care of, that's more than enough. This bite is not gonna matter. I mean, it's gonna matter in the sense that we're not gonna be able to use that arm ever. But, you know. Okay, take a rest. Go back out. If we use this, we're really slow. But I mean, being able to... Okay, here comes another group. Come on, bosos! Woohoo! That was close. Okay, here come more. There you go. Okay, we're doing it, we're doing it. Yeah, we need to equip this one on secondary. Man, not being able to use fence lines really makes this difficult. Our whole strategy revolved around that and two-handed weapons. I did not expect to hurt my right forearm while jumping a fence. I expected my leg, but my forearm, really? And then, like, you remember the last episode when I just jumped around the whole... <laughs> the whole episode? Like, really? You chose to hurt yourself now? Probably it was because of the panic. I should have taken... Desensitized. Where are you? Okay, there's a couple over there. They're pretty slow, though. Well, not, not actually. Some are slow, others are fast. There they go. Do any of you have anything useful? Duffel back with a shit rope. Nothing else. Okay. okay. Anyone below us? No, just you. Come over here, Boso! Okay, you're very fucking Brazilian. What the hell? I don't, but you're trying to kill me. Come on. Okay, darn. Jump. Ooh. We have to rest, we have to rest. Tactical retreat. Tactical retreat. is already low, huh? Okay. Let's see it when we're hungry. Did any of you have anything useful? You had a military knife, okay. It's something, I guess. Man, this, the pain. The pain is the thing that's gonna make this difficult. But it's okay, again, we only have to survive and kill every zombie that came with this Horde Knight. After that, we're free. Come on, Bowso! You fall over. Thank you. There you go. Uh, oh, you had a vest, but with two holes. Okay. That's not a zombie. Okay, here come more. There are so many. Whoa, I pressed the wrong button. Okay, I do not like the idea of losing this weapon. 
We could use leather strips, but I would rather not. Those are our bandages. Sir, please fall over. There you go. Do you have anything? Butterfly knife. Not really that great. Oh, we could make a spear with this, but... <laughs> I'm a little bit scared of using spears. If we could back... If we could get back inside... Why are you... Why are you hitting? What the hell? If we could only get back inside... I could try to look for more... One-handed weapons. Okay, here they come. Okay, I'm actually gonna use the gun. Okay, not bad. Okay, out of ammo. Ooh! That was close. Jump. The fence. Okay, reload. We still have ammunition. Oh, ho, 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 that was close. Secondary. What? Okay. Okay, that was a complete miss. That is fine. That is fine. Great, and we're also tired. Okay. There goes another one. Time to rest. Yeah, okay. We can rest here. We're getting hungry. Time to eat. Our, revol our revolver is a little bit easier to use. Okay, where are you? There you are. Oh, hello, you got inside there, huh? Oh, what, what was that? Over. There you go. Yeah, 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 you're just gonna die anyways. Okay, what the hell? Ah, uh, the ammunition is not the greatest. I mean, the aiming. Oh, really? We're getting tired. Oh, great. Let's eat the coffee then. Okay, 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 all right, all right, all right. Hello! Hi, you also joined the party, huh? Okay, come over here. Oh, really? Yeah, you also joined the party, huh? Thanks for joining us. Nice. We 
just gotta keep doing that. One bullet per zombie. Easy. Oh, we're starting to get tired. Yeah, the infection is starting to take over. We just have to survive. We have to win this night. If we do it, the infection will go away. I know it for a fact. Okay, let's go inside. Oh, we can't. Okay. Okay. We're starting to hit some barricades. Let's go inside, guys. We definitely reduced our numbers, so I think we might be able to do it. Come on, guys, get over here. Do you think they're upstairs, actually? They're probably upstairs. <laughs> oh, here's one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Keep laughing. See where that gets you. Here, no. Anyone in here? No. Oh, they completely shattered my fence line. Can we go through here? Yeah, we can. Okay. Yeah, I think they're all upstairs. see if I can see anyone from here. No. Oh, there's one. Let's see if we can bring the rest if we shoot a couple of shots. Mushroom soup. Thank you. They're not hitting this, are they? No, they're not. Oh, there's one. Yeah, please use the fence lines. Okay, they're hitting this barricade. Okay, okay. Here come a couple. Ooh, what do you have on your back? Hello. Oh, it's a spear. Oh, gotcha. Oh, great. You missed completely. battery-wise, pretty well. Just to make sure. Oh, great! They were here! Oh, God, no! No! Oh, no! Oh, no! We were so close! Oh, God, we almost did it! Oh! They were outside. Why were they there? <laughs> uh, we were very close. We killed 137. So I think most of them stayed upstairs. Darn. <laughs> Darn. We almost did it. We almost did it. But we just had to hurt. 
our right forearm. That was that was the thing that killed us. That was it. That was the thing that ended this run. Oh, so close. So close. So close. Well, that marks the end of Heather Mason. She fought like hell. She survived for 31 days. 32, I think. In case, if you're wondering why it wasn't like 30 exactly, it's because Horde Knight, the mod, had a little bit of issues. So I couldn't make it work. I had to do some fiddling, but technically we survived 30 nights of horror. <laughs> but yeah, we almost did it. We almost did it. We'll have to revisit this one. Maybe next year. <laughs> see if we can do it by then. Let's see if we'll be better. Okay. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Please leave a like if you enjoyed this episode and this series in general. If you have any ideas on what kind of series I could make, please don't hesitate to leave your ideas in the comments down below. If you have a good one, I'll probably make it someday. So yeah, thank you all for watching. Bye bye